Oh man, my head hurts, dude. We had too much to drink last. What it? What is this place? Um. Did you build this? I I don't I don't think so. I mean, God, it was a long night. Oh, uh, so much milk. That's what it is. There's our house. Yeah, there's our house. The Pum Cave. Yeah, dude. Let's uh. This is an impressive structure. It is. Yes. Whoever built it must be a fucking genius. Yeah, I think <laughs> I think I saw you building this with your clothes off last night. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, sometimes you just gotta let it all hang out. Yeah, yeah. But no, in all seriousness, um, I did build this because, as you know, my sense of direction is is terrible. Me. Good shot. <laughs> yeah, I could actually like come out with a pump cave here, turn around three times, and get lost. It just is that bad. Yeah, I've so, seen it happen, guys. Yeah, this being right outside our house, it's it's not only a, a nice little viewing platform, watchtower. But it's just—it's a good landmark for me to be able to make my way back. Because I believe today we are planning just to go out into the wilderness at some point and just explore the land. We've not really seen much of the surrounding area. We've seen the house a lot and under the house, but right. I, I think we need to, well, to go exploring, you know. Where exactly did this does this bridge go to? Ah, well, because there was so much lava underneath our house. We need somewhere to get diamonds from, so I built a mine at the other side of this bridge. You can just about see it. Ooh, actually, I have Optifine installed now. So if... Yeah, the zoom. There we go. Nice. So that is the entrance to our mine over there. I hear a zombie. Ah. But yeah, I wanted to start like some proper, full-on, heavily intensive branch mining to get lots of lovely diamonds. And yes. There's much less lava over there. So, but um, I believe you have been working on the house as well. So, yeah, I've been hard at work. Um, got rid of all the dirt and everything, and well, you guys can see for yourself. On the checkered floor, that's gone. Yeah, it's, that was a headache. It's actually so, looking quite pristine. Yeah, pristine. That's a that's a good one. I like it that. is. And we've got some coloured wool behind the chest. It's, it's a nice little yes. touch. Ooh, and a library. See, I haven't really seen much of this. Um, I can just left the server up last night. And Look at the piggy on the wall. And, uh, yeah, it's very nice. Would you paint that yourself? Yeah. Um. Yes. That that lady right there. Is... Yes. Yeah. God, she's beautiful. Yeah, she is hot. That is that is like full on pixelated, orgy like. Godless type to. stuff. I'm not. I'm not even sure where to go with this description, but yeah, let's, <sighs> let's go down here with that description. Okay. We've we finished the melon farm. Yes. Um, yes. This thing I have seen. There we go. Just, just do that again, just so the people can see the delay. It's beautiful. There it goes. Right. And Pop. as you can see, the the lights will cancel out. These the stems you cannot grow. If there is a block, a opaque block or a solid block over them, if you put a half slab, it will still cancel the light out, as well as um, the pumpkins and melons will be able to grow. And when that I put it back sense. up, the light cancels out. I just, I just thought that was kind of cool. I may do a uh, tutorial let's, if you let's guys just hold like. Up. Just... Oh, sorry, carry on. Oh no, sorry. If, if you guys just want to show us in the comments, if you guys want me to make a tutorial, I definitely will. Yeah. But, but yeah. anyway, well, we're on. not gonna get shit spawning in here, are we? While it's up. No, I've I've already checked the light levels. They're okay, good. good. That's why I, I put a I put a uh, torch behind that. Just don't want some like check. terrifying like melon rapist monster coming to get us in the sleep. Yeah, three fucking creepers come in and just blow the whole house to smithereens. Yeah. Kaboom, son! But anyway, as you guys can see, there's not too much dirt on the roof anymore. It looks real sleek and sexy for your ass. Yes. You've moved the animals out because the sound was driving us crazy. We still have the chickens up, but we're thinking of moving them out as well at some point. Or moving them right. back. Oh, and we forgot about outside. Outside? Yes. Follow me. Ooh, there's, a couple, uh, there's a couple more inventions we had made, and yes. one that we worked on for at least a sh 
a whole straight day. Oh my god, is that slimes on the overworld? Yes. Yes. Um, Unhorse was kind enough to develop our spawn chunk downstairs. And, and it took a long fucking time. Yes. But now we end up with lots of little, like, slimy chunks up here. Which yep. is and beautiful. We'll, uh, yeah, we'll definitely ex elaborate on how we made this uh, later yes. on. This lovely contraption, as you can see, we've done a tutorial on this before. Yep. Basically built two of these side by side. If unhorsed is a, a skellywag with a bow and arrow, I would then lure a creeper into this one and basically stand here and the skeleton would try and shoot me, kill the creeper, and we get music discs out of it. Exactly, yeah, we've got, we've got a good bit. I don't think we've got all of them, but we've got a good bit. No, we have got quite a lot of them, though. I added extra security as well, because um, when a skeleton is trapped in here, and I'm trying to lure a creeper to this one, I'm getting shot in the face repeatedly. So I added these little bits onto the end, so if you stand back here and trigger that, that will not crush the skeleton, but it will block him from view. He will not be able to shoot me. So I get a creeper in here safely, go trigger the lever, skeleton starts trying to kill me again. It's all very nice. And if I may say, this contraption is a YouTube first for anything. Um, I've never seen this before, and I've, I do a lot of searching and research about all this kind of shit, and I've never seen this. This is amazing. I love I love all this, uh, you know, the downward protection, all that. So I actually made chance. something new. That's right. I actually had no idea. I just I thought I would make some sort of shutter system to stop me getting shot when I'm luring stuff in. Right, there's right. there's well, a spider right here. Yeah, I just killed a few. Ah, right. Well, let's anyway. Go, yeah, let's go back in the house and show the rest of the, uh, give the rest of the fucking tour. Just say. Right, this what? needs to be a little more elaborate. Um, it's like, yeah. As extensive as the house is, I we just have to shit a little trap now. <laughs> yeah. Although if anyone does come in the server, they could never find us. No, no. The huge watchtower and all the pumpkins dotted outside the cave is no yeah, clue no. or indication of what. There goes one now. Look. Oh, He'll go up to the surface. Although you want to change this, don't you? Yeah, I'm gonna make this room a lot bigger because we've got a little. Etho style. I, actually, I don't even know who made this first, but these little buggers right here spit out potions at you. I, I think we used up all the potions. I'm pretty sure we did. Yeah, yeah well, we, we have a, a few gas tiers, so we can start making some more. They'll spit them out at you. And, hey, what's up, buddy? How you doing, man? I lost you for a while, and I realized you were over here. All right. Yeah, I guess I sat him down over there. He probably glitched over there, but anyways, yeah. For all of you that don't know, slimes will climb ladders. Small um, slimes. I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just the small slimes, but we'll we'll show you more about that in a minute. For now, we've yes. got, uh, as you could tell, the animals are not in the in the pen yes, where they go. Yes, yeah, we moved them out. We didn't rape and kill them. They are over here. No, we only raped and killed a few of them. Um, right, yeah. But yes, with them being down here, there's less noise. We extended the grass down to this bit as well. Right. Hey, piggy. Hey, Piggy, look alive. Look alive, buddy. <laughs> just in there yeah, on his own. That is a sad sight. Yeah, he's uh, he's just sniffing the buds but, right yeah. now. It's, this is a fairly boring part of the saw, though. Um, Man, ah! Oh, fuck! Bully! Fuck? No, someone, someone pushed me in. What an asshole. <laughs> what an asshole. He's probably the oh. Best oh, my God. How I wish we had PvP on right now. You would not stand up to my sword of sharpness, too. I'd be credit carding your ass with a watermelon right now. Yeah, huh. Um, so, are we going to show them the slime farm, or are we just going to go running off into the wilderness and try not to die? Yeah, let's let's check it out. Um, spent too much time for, for to not to not uh to not show off. Show oh off. my god! Look at this guy what? over here. Ooh. What's up, guy? God, yeah, this this uh, splat splat. And I just want to give you know, a little it's insight on my opinion that if if you guys really think that building huge, extensive, you know, traps and, uh, you know, you need five slime chunks to make a good, efficient farm, we have one chunk. Yes, um, that's it. And, 
in, in like one spawn pad and one that might not work, but And do we have what over two stacks of slime balls now? Right, exactly. I mean it's it's not worth it to make to, to go through the trouble of making you know, extensive farms. Like yeah. it's it's really not worth it. I think the only reason you would want to go bigger, better, badder for your slime farm is if you're on like a big server and you want to use slime as like a, a trading commodity. Yeah, that too. But this guy right uh, here. Yes. So he just gets pushed around by the currents. Right. So where the hell are you? Oh, I'm right here. Did you go for a swim? No, I'm right here. I'm on the uh, ah. spawn pad. There you are, sir. There's a ladder over here that I've made so we can get ah. down there. Right, okay. But yeah, we've used the uh we've wow, used slow going. He might he might be stuck. He'll move eventually. Yeah, after you poke him with the sword a few times. <laughs> yeah. Well, I wanted to go now. Now, now, yeah. now. Oh, there's another big one around here. Use the sign and stair trick so that the you know, yeah. slime people can easily get transported into this corner. Wherever you are, let's turn my video camera. I'm up here somewhere. Here, down here. This is better, uh, uh, better view. Uh, the what? Should I just jump down? Down the ladder? The ladder right here. Right. I knew that. Down the ladder. He's never even been here before. He's lying. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Anyway, I don't. I don't like work. Get rid of these torches and put, put a, uh, what you might call it, in the ceiling. Oh. But yeah. This guy's anyways, glitching. to explain this, the uh, all different types of slimes get spawned in here. They yes. will eventually jump in the water. Um. The Big and medium ones will go down here, and the water is too deep, and they cannot get out of it. They will drown, like like that. Just did. Yep. And there is a little cubby down there that only the small ones—it's only one block high—only the small ones can yes. go to a specified ladder and go all the way up to uh, uh, where we. I, I actually track. feel like I should take a swim down there to show them, but um. Oh my God! Are you kidding me? What'd you do? We can't I, live down here. I did nothing. Real players cannot be here. No, help me. That—that that was not scripted, dude. That was—that was just cold-hearted, cold-blooded, son. Noob. Nice. But no. If you remember what we did with a chicken farm, we used a sign to stop the water running, you know, down the hole, and that's what we've used down here. So the slimes, even though they're at the bottom of the pool. Since we're only one block high, the small slimes are actually not in water. It's, right, it's yes. genius. That is the best way I can describe it without flinging myself in. Right, and Jeb, if you're listening, please, please, oh my god. If you're listening, Jeb, please don't fix that. You know, please don't let water... Um, the, 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 the sign and water effect be transplanted with something you know, horrifying. Yeah, well, you see, that's the thing. A lot of these like really cool inventions are built off the backs of bugs, really. Yeah, exactly. If they end up getting patched out, I'm hoping there will be some sort of alternative will be implemented. And... Ooh, into the Nether. Sipping on some purple, we got this. Ah, yes. Just the most basic um, Nether wart farm for you. Very basic. Just a little fat, a uh, couple facts. Uh, obviously, Nether warts can only be built on soul sand and only in the Nether, and they need as much light as possible. If you remove light sources, so the light levels are lower, they will not grow. They'll actually pop out of the ground. See, I'd have thought it was the other way around. We should find them under stairs and stuff. I would have thought I they'd grow in dark, dank areas. Yeah, I think it used to be that. It used to be you needed it as dark as possible. I may be wrong, but uh. But yeah. Well, you, you told us that we could grow melons on concrete. <laughs> yeah. what, what what else have you been lying about? Yeah, we don't know if that's not true. Yeah, all right, yeah. That's how you're going to cover your ass. Yeah. Viewers at home, I'd just like you to uh, try it out. See if you can grow melons on, on stone. And leave as many comments damning his whole melons on concrete thing. Unless, unless it's right, and then you, you don't have to leave comments. Just, yeah, we'll just, we'll just forget about it. You will 
make you will crush my soul if you do that. Damn Yay. it. But yes, we'll we'll think of a new entrance for for the pump cave. God, look at all those dude, look at this. Christ. Yeah, th this <laughs> See, this one just chunk my point. One chunk, one spawn bit like That is just crazy. This is why we have like over two stacks of slime balls and growing. Right. And if you're wondering this is not the finished product, um actually, our friend Big here, what did what did you find over on your uh, path of destruction? Um, ooh, skeleton spawner. Yeah. Yes. So, that's over in the mine way over there. Let's forget about that for now. Though. I want to go exploring. Yeah, let's do that. This is a bit of pretty. Cool. Is, the only reason I mentioned that is because we don't need the experience from this. We're just gonna straight drop into the ground and. Yes. Splat the slimes. Exactly. Well. Let's, carry on. This has been a pretty long introduction here. We've we've got a lot to show basically. Yeah, um, we've uh, been hard at work. Yeah, we've been working on the house off camera because we figured it would be a pretty boring episode of Let's Play if it was just us walking about the house going, let's change the walls here and uh, <laughs> yeah. we'll dig this piece of floor out and it's not good. Ouch. So, idiot. But yes, <sighs> this is why we're going out. I still have nether wart on me. Yeah, well, oh and a gas tier. Let's hope I don't die. No, please don't die. Please don't. If I die, you just have to grab my stuff and run. Yeah, I'd have to do that. Yeah. Hello, sir. Goodbye. Oh, fuck. What, what was you I hitting? Dead. I think it was dead. Yeah, uh, just getting cocky. Hey there, Mr. Zumble. So, anyway, um, you're still our navigator. I have my landmark up, but you still need to, to find the way. So, if you want to pick a direction, we'll, we'll explore that area of the world. And See what we can find. Well, I do say, I guess we should go. What direction is this? Direction one. Direction one. Minecraft does not use east, south, west, north. Why? I don't know. It's rather sad, isn't it? Minecraft is too cool for true directions. Right. I mean, is car are cardinal directions really that hard to replace with? Yes. I mean, it's. That's all they did was replace fucking east, east, north, south, west with one, two, three, four. That's, that's oh. looks really suspicious. Uh, oh, yeah. quite painful. Uh, um, no, one thing I would love for them to do is fix that damn compass. It points to your like spawn points, but as soon as you place a bed down, it becomes useless. I would right. just rather have the compass either point true north or just point towards your current spawn point. You know. I don't think they thought about that very much. Did, um, oh, did you bring an axe on you by chance? Uh, I don't have one. I don't, no, I do not. Right. Why, are you after the white wood? Or? No, actually, I'd, I'd rather make a tree farm at the house, but... Just wondering. Because I didn't have one. Yeah. So... We really haven't come with the whole be prepared attitude, have we? Not exactly. We just um, kind of showed people some shit and then ran off. And then just winged it, yeah, we're just <laughs> winging these guys, so, uh, <laughs> sorry about that. So, yeah. off into the woods we go. With a spider chasing you. You fucking spider. Spider! You I, spider! I don't mind those spiders. It's, it's the small poisonous ones that do my head in. Dicks. Does my fucking nutting. Okay. It's so annoying. God Christ. I'm not really one to carry around buckets of milk on me, so I find myself ill prepared when it comes to those guys. Ooh, snow biome. Really? Oh fuck yeah. Oh, do we have any um do we have any bones? Oh I just of course I would make all my bones into bone meal. Um I have two bones. Ooh, could get another dog. Yeah. This is going to be my dog, though. Right. Since you made such a big deal of it last time. He was in yes, Frederick. Yeah. Oh, stop your niggering. <laughs> if that's the right term. <laughs> niggering? Is, is, that, is, that, is that not right? Uh, Nick. That's not even a... Well, you got knackered, but that's 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 completely different. <laughs> You you really need to avoid trying to be English. You just it doesn't work out. 
Right, right. I'm pulling a Lindsay Lohan over here. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that movie. Ooh, and a sheep. Yeah. See, how far have we come to find sheep and snow before? It's, it's a black sheep as well. No, light grey sheep, or dark grey sheep. Oh, fine. Yeah, grey. Whatever. Um, you don't just get wolves confined to snow biomes, do you? They're like everywhere. I think it's it's rare, but you can find them in other places. And I don't know if it's just adjacent to snow biomes, but I think they're mainly found in snow biomes. Right. You have to do a little wiki, wiki research. Uh, we'll do that at some point. Or again, just work for the um the inundation of air comment or two. Oh, what are you shit, doing? In bed. There's a zombie down there as well. God. Oh, look what he dropped. What did he drop? He gave me a new sword. Hey. Check that out. Sword that you don't need, but nice never mind. Guy. Ouch. That's a bummer. Got a spider. Oh, God. Oh, Christ. I am a lifesaver. Sorry? So I am a lifesaver. Nice. Look at all, look at this look at this conjunction of pigs. Conjunction of pigs. Yeah, did you see that? Dude, we I, I ran up where are you at? I where are you at? I'm, I'm placing a light. Here. Look this a that, There was there was like five pigs. They were like all they were just all standing by each other. And then I came up on them and they just disbanded and took off. Ah. These pigs must have been plotting some sort of evil dominion over men. I think I you think caught them Canadian. in the middle of a, a conspiracy. I think they're Canadian pigs, to be honest with you, because wouldn't it be cool if they had like Canadian pigs, Canadian bacon? Mm, bacon. I love bacon. The fuel of a man equals bacon. Yes. Holy shit! And there is a lot of bacon here. Look at this. Yeah, it's this is what? Pig City, right? This is it. Planet of the Pigs, which is right. Although I do feel a bit bad about hitting them with a diamond sword of sharpness too. It seems, it seems a bit overkill for pigs. I feel like I'm wasting the sword. Dude, maybe we should leave them here. Like, they're obviously just going to repopulate. What? Look at all these fucking leave them? If we leave them, they'll be marching on the pump cave within two days. <laughs> That's what it seems like. Shit. I, I think it'd be awesome if you could find... Just random colored sheep, just like purple sheep floating about. Yeah, well I have seen some before, but they've been in multiplayer servers, so I assume people have died them, and then they've glitched out and escaped into yeah. the wilderness. Right. If you remember the last server we used to play together, um, I believe there was like a, a sheep just floating outside in the ocean for about two days. Yeah. <laughs> just just yeah, swimming just... there, he was just there for days and days. And... You eventually oh, no, shot no. it with a bow. Yeah. Ooh, now we come up on the cow army. Right? Yeah, we, we, were, pl we were playing uh, who could kill the pig first before we could even say the title of the game. Um, I accidentally shot him. Yeah. So, again, sorry. It was going to be a fun game because right. it, was, it, it was quite far out in the ocean, but then I was like, let's see who can kill it the first. Like, first, we'll, we'll take it in turns, taking shots at it. Uh, yeah, it just like popped out of existence. Yeah. What a bastard. My Call of Duty sniper skills came into play. Oh, you're a Call of Duty guy, are you? No, no, I mean... No, I no, no, like... you've, you've said it now. <laughs> I, I'm a battlefield boy, but you're Call of... Uh, I don't think we could be friends anymore, you know? <laughs> Whatever, I mean... <laughs> really hurt my feelings. Look, a tree pig! I found a tree tree. tree. You no, you never. You found a pig tree. Look at this. There's there's three tree pigs. Pig yeah, trees. It's, it's a pig tree. Trees that pigs grow on. Pig tree. A pig tree. Tree pig. Pigs that grow in trees. Yes. Oh. Ah, that was awesome. I love tree pigs. Pig trees. Um, oh god, this is not going to end well. You may be dying. This is not going to end well! Rise! <laughs> well, that's a point. These zombies aren't gonna die in the sunlight, are they? Yeah, 
raining? Yeah, the rain will extinguish them. And if and if you notice, you know, it's it's fucking it's daytime and now all the monsters decide to come out. Yeah, I think the monsters just didn't have space to spawn in between all the pigs and cows. Yeah, that might have been it. Oh look, and to your right, you will see a light brown sheep. God, it's a sexy ass sheep. Right. I thought he was going to point out something really interesting then. Unfortunately, not too many interesting stuff spawns in Minecraft. Yeah. We need more like unique stuff. Rare item drops and like rare scary monsters. Like, you know, maybe some sort yeah, of I giant spider somewhere that is like really rare, but when you see it, you best hope you have like all diamond armor or you can run really fast. So, Notch, like you were saying about the red dragon, please implement that. Ooh, yes, cool. yes, that would be cool. Something like deep, that. Deep in a lava layer, maybe. Yeah. Or maybe like, um,. Some sort of epic monster for each oh. kind of biome. What the fuck? Yeah. That was scary. Yeah, so like a, a special epic kind of monster for each biome, but they'd be really, really rare. And the ones above land, obviously, yeah. not really, really powerful. But yes, and some sort of deep lava layer for like. Um... Hey, I like this. Waterfall nice. going into the ice. It's beautiful. God, this is fun. Nice serene area. Yeah, look at this. this is, God, this is beautiful. I've always wanted to make like a, you know, just slowly and steady make a um, an ice house. You just put like a piece of water down, wait for it to freeze, so on and so forth. Because ah, it's right. only stagnant water freezes. So ice is kind of like um, growing grass over dirt. Yeah. It just has to be in a snow biome and touching other ice maybe or can any yeah. water freeze as long as it's in snow biome right I, I guess this this will be a our 1.2.5 snapshot um, introduction but the newest snapshot that came out um, what does it include you've got a lot of you've got single player commands you've yeah. got Kinds of business. I'm glad um, they introduced that. But I mean, the last snapshot sounded a little boring. But um, the chest thing—you should tell them about the chest thing. That that sounds really cool. Oh yeah, they've got um, it's called bonus chest, and when you start out, what the fuck? You starving to death? No. Oh, it's it's the elusive invisible cactus. It happens sometimes. Ah. Ah, yes, yes, there it is. <laughs> I yeah. found it! There it is. Um, yeah, so bonus chests. Yeah. I, 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 at first, I thought that there was chests scattered. Ah! Sorry, I found another invisible cactus. <laughs> ah, Jesus! They're all, all over right, the place! They're everywhere. Help me! Oh my god. Fuck it, you know. So, again, bonus chests. Yes, they... They're not scattered all over the map like I thought they were. It's just at the beginning mm -hmm. you get a little like wood sword. It's it's randomly generated like everything else. All right, so it's kind of like a starter set then to like get you on your Pretty way. Much. That's what it should be called. You know what? I've I've never found one of those desert wells yet. Have you have you seen one? I have not. It'd be kind of fun to find one. Yeah. So yeah, I thought I'd just throw it out there. Um, I've mentioned it in a comment on one of our videos, but we are thinking about having guests on our little Let's Play from time to time, yes? Yeah, definitely, for sure. So yeah, I mean, um, when we talk about guests, we're not talking about just friends we know, we're talking about people who subscribe or watch the videos. If you play Minecraft and you wouldn't mind being on the channel, uh, we'll probably maybe, I don't know, maybe run a competition or something. Uh, yeah, definitely. Come on down. Yeah, some sort of lottery. But pretty cool to get people on here and you get to see the pump cave and come on some sort of random adventure. Yeah, definitely. That would be, be real fun. Do, do exactly what we're doing. We need a, we need another guy up in here. Yeah. Uh, we're kind of getting a bit lonely for the man love. Um, yeah. 
Bromance can only take you so far. Only so far. We've come a long way. Yeah, and well, we've not found anything. Right. But then again, what are we looking for? I mean, I just wanted to explore the <laughs> land, but... We're looking for fun. I haven't found fun yet. Fun! <laughs> yes, fun. A wild fun appears. Whoa! Look at this. An ice ocean. Ooh. tally -o. This is nice. Did that not hurt a little bit? Yeah, I twisted my ankle. Fanny. Walk it off. Fanny? Yes. You call me a fanny? Yes. You're a fanny. Yeah, there there is a bit of a a difference between the American fanny and the English <laughs> fanny. Yeah. See, if you're thinking American fanny, you're about an inch out, if you get my meaning. An inch out, that sounds like... <laughs> well. it, it means vagina! <laughs> <laughs> But, but anyway, let's press on. But you yeah. know what? I actually, I like this area. Have a look around. This is like a really nice panoramic oh. view going on. Trapped on the ice. Oh, you noob. Saw Doggy! Where? Loads of them. Hello. Hello, pups. I've only got three bones. Let's try it out. Okay. Need that one. Hey, got one on my first bone. Where are the others gone? No. Damn it! Wasted three bones on this bitch. Let me try. Stay still, doggy. Stay st st stay still. He's already horny, so get him. Horny? Yeah, I, I buttered him up with some bones. I thought, Jesus, this this is like some sort of crafty ninja wolf, <laughs> spider wolf. He's like off up in trees and everything. Fuck it. He's taken off. No, no, I've had him break his leg at some point round here. Ah, he's no good for me. I think oh, this wow. is the guy. I figure if you wasted three bones on him, there's a good chance I can get him. Come back! Oh, I got him! Nice. Yeah, this. I have two doggies following me. You have none. <laughs> Where the fuck are you? Oh, I'm kind of lost now. I think I may have to eat my dogs. <laughs> What art thou? Good man. No, seriously, where the fuck are? Ah, yeah, so you are. Get up on to here. Yeah, I just wanted to show how awesome this seed is. If huh. you look at this. This is a beautiful little chasm. Chasm, whatever you call it. Chasm. Um. If you guys want the seed. Yeah, I was just about to say. You cannot have it. You can't have it. They can't? No. Special. Okay. Sorry, dudes. But, um, unhost has spoken. Even though technically it's my server. <laughs> but no, no. We, we shall keep this seed. And take the guests. Right. You can come check it out with us. And make your own adventure. We'll basically, you know, chase you around if you want, or. You can just come with us on one of these inane rambles through the countryside. Yeah, exactly. And, well, this was fun as we pretty much had no rhyme or reason to come out here. But, anyways, what do you say? See you guys next time. Yeah, see you next time. We, we'll, we'll think of an objective for the next one. <laughs> we promise. But, uh, see you guys later. Adios. Bye-bye.